hope is often talked about at Christmas, but why? It's one of those words which has so many layers and meanings. When considering the struggles and depth of suffering for people affected by leprosy, then how can we talk to them, or any friend really struggling, about hope? It can sound so trite. This might be because we don't fully understand hope. Hope is not always a feeling. It can be, but sometimes it must be a decision. A bit like love and faith. Married couples know at times they don't feel love. They need to decide to love. Equally, many Christians have both felt faith and at times decided to have faith when feelings and even God seem far off. So too, perhaps, it's more helpful to consider hope as a decision. And what are we deciding? Not to hope for a better car or better health, job, spouse, home or friends. You may get all of these things, and Jesus may want you to have all of these things, but we should not place our hope in them. Ultimately, all of them are fragile and fickle. Each can let you down. Jesus stated from his birth that he is the Son of God, and he offers us life in him, for now and forever, the ever-dependable. Hard concepts to understand, mysterious even, but when grasped through the veiled, dim eyes of even the tiniest faith, It represents incredibly good news. And can this faith be for me? Others may be, but me? The birth of Jesus reminds us that the Christian faith is for all. The wise men were most certainly not Jewish, nor were shepherds regarded as the upper echelons of religional status. And so right from his birth, Jesus radically included those who were rejected and overlooked. He continued this theme throughout his life, accepting and commissioning the divorcee, the Samaritan, the tax collector, adulterer, homeless ex-offender, prostitute, to name a few, right up until his death, where he welcomed a criminal. Where others shunned and rejected, he radically accepted. He was their hope. Praise God for the reminder at Christmas that whatever struggles we face in life, Jesus is our hope. No matter what trials come our way in the days ahead, let's choose to put our hope in him.